Hey guys, how's it going? In this video, I have an unboxing for you. Um, it's a hard drive enclosure, so let me get my knife out here. I haven't done an unboxing for a while, I don't think. So, um, I have a 120 uh, gigabit hard drive that was from my, um, my PlayStation 3, and... I just upgraded it to the uh, 500 that was in my laptop and my Mac now has uh, 750 so um, I just have a 120 gigabit hard drive that's just sitting around so um, <clears throat> I got from Amazon so uh, let me put my knife away And this is just the receipt from the Amazon, the packaging, and this is exactly what I'm looking for. I don't think there's anything else in there, but I'll check it out later. This is what we're really looking for. Um, I don't know how you pronounce this really, but it's called a com data, I believe. And this is, I'll, it'll be in the name of the top, the uh, model will be in the title of the video, but um, I got this hard drive enclosure mainly because of the FireWire. Um, there was some reviews of some people saying the fire wasn't working, but for the price, I honestly could not. Um, I couldn't. I couldn't say no to it. So um, I think it was like f maybe fifty bucks if that for the hard drive enclosure. Um, I do pay a little bit more for it just because the cheap ones, uh, I remember recalling buying one that was like five bucks off Amazon and that enclosure did not work very well. And, um, but, um, USB 2.0, let's see, takes a SATA hard drive, Firewire 400, Firewire 800, which is the main thing I'm going to use is the Firewire 800, Firewire 400 when I use that. That was really awesome. Um, I hope you guys can see this, but um, the black box may not be able to. Mac and PC compatible. Also had some review, or there were some comments on the Amazon saying that Linux was able to recognize it too. If you guys are still using Linux, easy installation setup with a three-year limited warranty and free tech support forever. So, um, from what I was told, uh, there's some people on there said it was really good and then other people said it was bad but either way I'm still gonna do a review on it this is just the unboxing and uh, I'm probably gonna make it um, a, a two like video like um, two in one like a, the unboxing and the review both in it so um, I still need to unbox the rest of it um, Okay, and then this should just slide out. Yeah. There we go. Oh, another good thing is like I forgot to tell you guys that um, this does come with the cables. So, um, you don't have to buy the cables or anything like that. It comes with it. And here it is. It's very light. Um, casing, it could be better. Um, it's kind of what I expected to look like. Um, the logo's on the side. can barely see it. Um, here is really what we're looking for right there. I hope you guys can see that. This right here is the FireWire 800 port. This is the 400, and this is uh, the USB 2.0, and then this is the uh, AC, I think that's the AC power, but it should not require it, especially since I'm using it for the FireWire. The USB 2.0 might need it, but it, from what some people told me, it doesn't really require power. So, um, let me move some of this stuff out of the way, like I said. Firewire 800 cable, oh, another ooh, a 400 cable as well. Sweet. 
didn't know it was going to give me all those cables. And then another uh, USB 2.0. And I have plenty of those. So, um, and then there's some booklets and screws, mini screws. So, okay, I'm just going to keep those all together. Okay, so screws, booklets, USB 2.0 cable, 400 cable, FireWire 400, FireWire 800 cable, okay, and then your enclosure, perfect. So there's the unboxing, and then on to the review, you will see that next.